subscribe to our are. channel. If you haven't subscribed, subscribe. Reviews of Beautiful Boy, The Favourite, all sorts of things are out there. Anyway, this is a trailer. This is a Netflix trailer. No, it's a bit... So, The Umbrella Academy. Do you know anything about it? It's based on a Dark Horse comics series and it's set in 1977, my favourite year, because mm -hmm. it's the year Star Wars came out. Mm. But it's in an imaginary universe where John F. Kennedy wasn't assassinated. This has got wrong. In October 1989, 43 women around the world gave birth. None of these women had been pregnant when the day first began. I must do one for it. I have adopted six children. Gifted with abilities far beyond the ordinary. I give you the Umbrella Academy. Does anyone wish to speak? He was a monster. Everything about our family is insane. It always has. Skirt? Oh, yeah, this. It's very breathy on the bits. I used to see nothing's changed. I jumped forward and got stuck oh. in the future. Hey. You know what I found? Oh, Gina. Absolutely nothing. When's it supposed to happen? In eight days. Oh, shit. There's someone out there who's trying to stop me from preventing the apocalypse. We need the full force of the Academy. Bingo. Gay sisters? Gay sisters? Get up, we're going. Where? Save the world. Oh, is that all? I wasn't sure at first. I wasn't sure at first. There's always that sort of moment with a new Netflix series where you can't tell whether it's going to go Riverdale yeah. or really cool. That's what I think it looks like. Do you think it looks Riverdale-y? Yeah. Do you? Bits of it did, especially the beginning, but I felt like once they were older, it kind of went more. So is this a series of the latter Umbrella Academies? Because the, the original Umbrella Academy was set in the, in the 70s. So, oh. um, so maybe this is, the, but there was a sequel, so, yeah. there, so maybe this is more recent. Yeah, 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 I'm trying to work out what they're trying to do there. There's a bit of Suicide Squad in there. Yeah, I felt very suicidal. Yeah, I felt, I like felt it Suicide Squad-y. Well, having a... that kind of music with all of the yeah. fighting. And yeah, everything. yeah, a crazy set shade of winter, whatever it was. Um, and then you've got a bit of almost Harry Potter. Yeah. With the school uniform <clears throat> and the boy running around. Yeah. Then you've got a bit of Hereditary's Doll's House, as you see them all in that oh, shop, all with them all in their rooms. Yeah. I think it looks pretty, I'll definitely watch it. I do like Is that. it a series then? Yes, yeah. a series, yeah, yeah. I do like that girl from Juno. Yeah, me too, yeah, she's yeah, a really yeah. good actress. I quite like that I'll watch short. it. And the other problem, do you ever find this, that when you go to a TV series or a Netflix series, mm -hmm. and you know there are special effects, that you think they're gonna be worse because it's a TV series? Yes, sometimes. Do you know, do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. like they've got the money for the cinema, but when it comes to a series, it's gonna get a bit Doctor Who-y. Yeah, it looked kind of all right in that. It did, the monkey yeah, looked yeah, yeah, yeah. 